Sound is a wave, specifically a pressure wave. But how do these waves move? To understand how they move, we need to understand how they're created. If you imagine an object moving back and forth, when it moves forward, it will compress the air in front of it. And when it moves back, it will leave behind a region of low pressure. So we're left with a region of high pressure and a region of low pressure. This creates our pressure wave. Now this wave doesn't just stay still. As you can see, the high pressure will be forced out in both directions. The air will move into the region in front of it and into the region of low pressure. So as you can see, half of the air from the high pressure region will move forward and the other half will go back into the low pressure region. Which means that this region is now not of high or low pressure. But it's still moving due to its momentum, so it leaves behind a low pressure region with a high pressure region in front of it and a normal pressure behind. So we still have our pressure wave of high and low pressure, but it has now moved forward. And this process repeats itself continually, moving the wave forward even more.